All right, let's go uh, to... And I want you to listen to, to, I mean, and the moderators on this too. The moderators uh, editorialize sort of fantastically on this. This is uh, Bernie on how he'll raise taxes. And, well, here, just keep an eye out for, I can't remember what the, the woman's name who was one of the moderators. She was from, I think, uh, the Iowa paper or something. Go ahead. In the last 30 years, there has been a massive redistribution of wealth. And I know that term gets my Republican friends nervous. Problem is, this redistribution has gone in the wrong direction. Trillions of dollars have gone from the middle class and working families to the top one-tenth of one percent who have doubled the percentage of wealth they now own. Yes, I do believe that we must end corporate loopholes such that major corporations year after year pay virtually zero in federal income tax because they're stashing their money in the Cayman Islands. Yes, I do believe there must be a tax on Wall Street speculation. We bailed out Wall Street. It's their time to bail out the middle class, help our kids be able to go to college tuition free. So we pay for this by due demanding that the wealthiest people and the largest corporation who have gotten away with murder for years start paying their fair share. But let's get specific. How high would you go? You've said before you'd go above 50 percent. How high? We haven't come up with an exact number yet, but it will not be as high as the number under Dwight D. Eisenhower, which was 90 percent. But it will be. <laughs> I'm not that much of a socialist so. compared to Eisenhower. <laughs> We are going to end the absurdity, as Warren Buffett often reminds us. That's right. That billionaires pay an effective tax rate lower than nurses or truck drivers. That makes no sense at all. There has to be real tax reform, and the wealthiest and large corporations will pay. Okay, so I think it was KB, uh, K, uh, uh, Kathy Oberdovich. Um, but, but nevertheless, you could hear her at one point say, well, hope so. Now, understand, too, the thing that's not being communicated here is that it's not 50% of all the money a wealthy person uh, earns. It's not 50% of uh, a, a millionaire's uh, income. It is 50% over a certain amount that they earn. So they pay the same taxes for their first 30000 They pay a lower rate for their first 100000 And then when you start getting up around 200000 or whatever the, <clears throat> the point is, They pay more on every dollar afterwards. That is called a graduated income tax. And the idea that even these reporters don't know what that means is absurd.